Hello everyone, Dan here from the Next Issue Podcast. On today's video, we'll be doing a review for Ninja Kamui Episode 8. This is the ongoing anime that you can watch on Adult Swim or on Max on the next day. Um, this is actually going to be probably a pretty quick video. Um, I really enjoyed the episode because it's one of the most... Like, it just went by like a breeze. Like, it was very quickly paced. We have this big fight. Um, there's not a lot that happens here. Uh, so let's get into it. And I'm going to get into spoilers. So if you haven't seen the episode, go check it out. I really enjoyed it. Uh, but like I said, it, it feels like it went through in a blink of an eye. Um, so in this episode, as Higan and Lil engage in combat, uh, Higan, like he finally has his red armor on, his, his Kamui on, uh, and he's trying to connect with it. I almost thought they were going to have Higan like one shot this dude just to prove how strong he is with his new armor. But no, the fight went on a little bit longer than than I thought. Uh, so he does finally achieve that full synchro uh, with his Kamui. Uh, and it looks super cool. Like, he's just super powerful. The, go watch the fight. The fight's a lot of fun, actually. Uh, I knew the little pervert was going to finally die uh, because that's what these characters kind of do once the hero gets a hold of them. Um, I also thought Asuka was dead. We'll get into that in a minute. Uh, but yeah, really cool fight. Uh, everybody in the villains, like all the, the council of villains, like they, they see this and they're like, I think they're finally worried, or at least they finally have paid more attention because they are starting to move up their timelines for stuff. One really cool detail, like Higan tells Lil, like you thought you were going to die quick and it's not, it's going to be slow and painful, uh, because he's got a lot of revenge coming his way. Uh, and then we cut to a scene where they de uh, somebody delivered his box to the to the council of, of villain bosses, the you know the lieutenants, and his head, and it's all like burnt and, and beat to shit. So, yeah, pretty pretty graphic stuff. This this anime continues to surprise me uh, with the level of violence. Um, so, um, we also get a lot of um, backstory between Asuka and Mary, Mary or yeah Mari, uh, who was Higan's wife and. Within that story, not only do we get background on both of those characters and their relationship, but also how the clan kind of became the way that it is right now, how they moved away from their tradition and, and the things that they were doing uh, and more into this corporate structure that we see in the show now, like uh, how they eventually had to leave Japan. They started letting in people, uh, recruiting people that were not there for the same reason, right? I think uh the ninja organization had a lot of structure and values that they upheld and those were kind of diluted when they started bringing in all these outsiders uh, so we get to see a lot of that but i think the best part of this uh flashback is just understanding why asuka cares so much about higan and because mari meant so much to her um so i'm really glad we get to see a little bit more of that we get to find out more about mary's abilities or mari's abilities uh and how she was one of the three top ninja like like higan and uh uh zai so that was really cool so we get a lot of we get a lot of exposition and backstory in this one and i think that's why it went by pretty quickly because it was just like big fight big flashback and then we end with zai finally being let let loose of the you know yamaji finally let zai off the leash so uh big things are coming in the next couple episodes i'm sure uh so we'll definitely keep watching but if you've seen this episode, let me know what you thought about it down in the comments. As always, thank you for watching, everyone. Remember to share, like, subscribe, hit the bell so you know when we go live. That is most Saturdays, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. Stay tuned. We have more comic reviews, trailer reactions, TV recaps, all that fun stuff here in the channel. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye. <laughs>